Welcome to the 2019 Geico High School Nationals presented by Gatorade. Here in New York, we are a day closer to crowning a champion. The semifinals get underway with a Sunshine State showdown between Montford, the defending champion, and IMG. All chalk so far in this tournament, Montford and IMG, the 2-3 battle. Undefeated Lalamere, the top seed, taking on Oak Hill a bit later. Ted Emmerich alongside Paul Biancardi, along with Tara Petrolino. Paul, there are future stars all over the court in this first game, but let's start with the highest ranked player on the floor, IMG's Josh Green. Josh Green, an explosive athlete. He's best in the conversion game. Loves to finish over or around defenders with terrific body control. Very underrated passer. He had eight assists yesterday in their win. At 6-5, he gives smaller guards big time problems. On the other side for Montverde, it's Precious Achua, one of the best athletes in the senior class. He brings a strong rebounding game, a finish game, and he runs the floor with effort and speed. One of the best switch defenders in the class. He makes things happen for Montverde. Achua and Green, two of the four McDonald's All-Americans in this game. IMG, the first school to have three McDonald's All-Americans on the same team. And when the ball is in the air, we will have 10 ESPN-ranked players on the floor. The officials are in Barfield, Jim Nolan and Jared Jacobson. Just the fourth ever meeting between Montverde and IMG, and Harlan Beverly has an exclamation point to start. Montverde, RJ Barrett could very well join that group later this year. And he has a team of stars, but nobody like Barrett, Russell, or Simmons against IMG. This is the defense that we've seen all year long by Kevin Boyle. There's Josh Green hanging in the air. College for five years. Of course, the girls team for St. John's College High School just advanced to the girls national championship game tomorrow. Beverly going reverse side. Let's ask Tara, who do you have? I got Gino and I got UConn. All right, two, yeah, wait, again, two wait, against one. Way to go, we'll see Tara. About that. We'll see about that. Late in the shot clock, Kopravica, the dunk. It wasn't pretty, but it counts. Kopravica, Serbian, headed to play for Lennon Hamilton of Florida State. Oh, how about the hustle by Moses Moody? Highlight coming, Gene Cunningham! Explosion! Screen, cut, and move. If you don't move this defense, you're not gonna beat them in a one-on-one -on -one situation. Springer down the lane against Omar Payne. What a finish. And Omar Payne is a shot blocker who's headed to Florida. Beverly splashes in the three. Just the fourth all-time meeting between these two programs that have emerged on the national stage. Farrakhan, no, Robinson Earl puts it back home. Here comes Green. And Jaden Springer lays it home. IMG looking to run again. Oh, what a tap by Robinson Earl, and it leads to the slam for Josh Green. So much so to get them to believe how much it works. They have so much taken ice from a local 7-Eleven and filled a hotel bathtub to make sure that these guys all get ice baths while they're on the road. Can we get some of that after the game? Oh, get an ice bath for Harlan Beverly! Sports Center Top 10, dial this up. This was vicious by Harlan Beverly. He wanted a piece of that rim. He got the whole thing. Harlan Beverly on the baseline. If that's not a Sports Center top 10, I don't know what is. Here's Cunningham on the blow by, and he punches it home. I think the intensity is there today. Josh Green with the three for IMG. It's got to be more aggressive. It's got to be more active. And they all got to go to the glass. Precious Achua goes off the glass for two. Too easy. Make a play. Farrakhan remains down on one knee. Five on four for Montverde. Moody connects from long range. Moody, the scoop. It went coast to coast. Unacceptable. There's a three. Make it a long two by Jaden Springer. It is a two. Green and Springer have to step up in scoring, driving, and shooting. Achua feeds it to Balsa Kopravica. 
Great class coming in with Nico Mannion. They played AAU basketball together for West Coast Elite. Terry Armstrong, elite athlete. Kay Cunningham buries the triple. Especially when it's a big game. Nice pass. Baycott down to Robinson Earl working high-low for IMG. Hit in the hip. Good to see he's back in. Now he launches a three, and he makes it. Second year with IMG, transferring from St. Benedict's in New Jersey. Robinson Earl from the outside. Cunningham can't hit from the outside this time. Offensive board, Payne. Beverly the wraparound, and Payne banks it in. Replace the likes of R.J. Barrett company. The basket and the foul for Montford, Harlan Beverly. Springer now in double figures with 10. Beverly slicing in. He scoops it with a foul. You can't hang with Harlan Beverly. But he's also brought the intensity this season, which he didn't have when he came into Montford. He didn't have quite that edge, that competitiveness that he has now. Green going reverse side, acrobatic move. Nobody's been able to stay in front of Harlan Beverly. How about the jump stop, the balance, the body control? The concentration to finish, unbelievable. That's a big time move and a great finish. You know, Beverly's slick. He can beat you going right or to his left. We saw the left finish in the last possession, this one to the right. That's what makes a dangerous offensive player the ability to go right or left. Cunningham. Cunningham at the buzzer. Montford hoping to punch its ticket to the championship game here at Geico Nationals. Up by 16 as we start the fourth, and Armando Baycott starts with a big dunk. Now, IMG already made one comeback, down 17 at the end of one to close to within eight before Montford stretched the lead out again. Springer from the baseline. Same exact play. Bounds if you can right now. Walker's looking for Robinson Earl. He's got him. Oh, there's Walker to tip it in. The soft pressure by IMG has affected Montford on the offensive end. They've got tentative. They weren't sure. Springer off the crossover. We're tied at 64. Achua stumbling. Ball's loose. Copra beats on the layup. Montford back on top. Loose ball. Moody picked it up. Springer got it back. And Robinson Earl is able to stick it in. We're even at 66. And all he can do is watch from here on out. Walker gives IMG its first lead today. Baycott on the switch, Cunningham drills the three right over him. Because he didn't get out on that shot. Cunningham's third three. Robinson Earl, tough inside. Bringer and Cunningham at the point. Cunningham racing ahead, another bucket for the number 10 player in the junior class. This guy scored a lot. Jeremiah Robinson Earl, he's been fantastic. Think about the ways he scored in this game. Three-point shot, a post-up, now at the free throw line. He gets his buckets all over the court. Had a chance to tie it. Instead, a one-point game. 30 seconds remaining here in New York. Six seconds different on the game clock. Cunningham and Springer. Number 10 and number 11 in the ESPN 60. Here comes Green. Moody catching fire. Baycott pulls it down. Final seven seconds. Terrible Robinson Earl. The throw down. IMG with the lead. The clock wasn't running as Montverd was trying to run off the dunk. We've got a stoppage with 3.1 to go. 
Montverde called timeout, and the clock will reset to 3.8 seconds. Jeremiah Robinson Earl gives IMG the lead. Can IMG pull it out? Here's Moses Moody. Beverly takes the shot. Off the mark. IMG wins it. In the high school game, the madness comes in April.